Okay, so we're back, and I have now trimmed all the excess off of the bed boards. Um, measured each one individually instead of just a uniform because, like I said, they have a curve, so each one is different length. Um, measured them, did a line, individually cut them all the way. They're nice. They lay right. They're very nice looking. Um, I'm really happy that they turned out so well. I like that I can see that reflection too in the diamond plate of the wood. Seems like it makes it look like it continues on. That's cool. I have to polish that a little bit better and more. But um, so the wood, you know, the bed looks really good. There's the tailgate. Um, the tailgate does function. It does close. When I polyurethane the boards, um, I probably have to pay a little bit of attention to that and put a little bit extra. And I might have to, like, I might have to on these boards edge the top of them so that they're a slight 45 so the tailgate can close easy and I can get a nice coating of polyurethane on that end that's going to get subjected to water if it's out and about in the weather um, so I want to make sure I protect it now it will have strips in between so each one of these creek the cracks in between the boards is going to have a stainless steel strip so I just have to install that and cut that that's also another project and another step. But for now, we've got the boards cut. They're measured right. I'm really happy with how that turned out. And um, it's a great positive thing to move forward with uh, and further this project. So I'm gonna show you by closing the tailgate what it would look like. All right, and so here we go. Now this is a heavy tailgate. El Camino 1959 has a huge tailgate. It's very heavy, uh, as you see, <laughs> a lot of metal. Um, because the fins are incorporated. So we're gonna close it. It's very heavy. Sorry I'm gonna show you there. It's closed. It's you know almost there. So when we come forward with it, it has latches down inside Just like a pickup truck bed and we're gonna go ahead and close it Got to do a little bit harder There we go Now it's up this board puckered a little bit. I think he needs a little bit of tension cut off of him on the edge, so I'll have to take care of that. And other than that, our boards look good. Thanks.